guys, Slug Battles here. Wow, uh, the, ba the background, I got the windows uh, open because it's all sunny out here, so that's why. So anyway, for this video, I'm going to be talking about something that I really think is interesting to talk about and I uh, thought about if I wanted to talk about it in a video, and that is stepping out of the comfort zone. Now, getting out of the comfort zone for me personally is a very good thing. For those of you that don't know uh, what what it really means to you know stepping out of the comfort zone, the comfort zone is a thing where you get to do things that you really uh, enjoyed regularly and you know, doing some things that make you happy uh, all the time. And the comfort zone keeps you from entering the outside world where it has all the things that you've never experienced and, and make you feel like, I don't know about this one. I don't know if I really feel like doing it. And sometimes it gets a little bit boring, at least from my personal standpoint. I was in the comfort zone a lot actually on some of the things. For example, trying new fruits and vegetables. The first one that I ate uh, which is either one of those two, is broccoli. Now, I think I was at TGI Friday, uh, if I remember correctly. That, that was like either a year, a year ago or half a year ago while I was at school. And I was asked to try bro broccoli, and I'm like, I don't really know, but I'll tr give it a try. And then I try broccoli, and it turns out I like broccoli a little bit. All of that that I'm saying to you is just an example of, you know, getting out of the comfort zone. So if you are that person who has a hard time trying to figure out how to step out of the comfort zone or don't uh, find any real, uh, uh, very teachable, not teachable, just really good tips of how to step out of the comfort zone, I am just here for you to give you some tips. Do everyday things things differently and take a different route. It's very important to, you know, take a different a route to do other different things that you never do regularly. Like for example, when I was little, I was just about to do my very first uh, skating experience. And at that time, I was like, ah, I don't know how I feel about it. I might fall uh, while I was skating. But then uh, some part of me tells me that I really had to give it a try. So I did. And while I still had a feeling that I, a bad feeling about it, I still keep get, giving it a try. And somehow, some way, I started skating. And I actually somewhat enjoy it. It's another example of how to step out of the comfort zone. So yeah, do things differently each and every day and try to take a different route to do other different things that you didn't do uh, like on a regular basis. Take your time making decisions. This is actually a very important tip to step out of the comfort zone. Taking your time before making an ultimate decision to do something different is very important to do because it helps you do other things that will help your lifestyle better and help yourself as well. If you make a decision before you're uh, taking your time to think about it before deciding it, it, something might not be good for you and you might just end up doing the same things over and over and over and over again repeatedly endlessly without stop I pretty much end up like that sometimes not very rarely although but then as I grew older I started uh, practicing on taking some time before making a decision on some of the things that I want to do differently and I can't uh, name the things that I uh, did differently because there are, are a whole lot that I can't name in this video because it'll take so long. But uh, I did do some things differently after uh, taking some time to think about the decision before deciding to, you know, make the decision. <laughs> so yeah, taking your time before making a decision is always important. It helps you a lot. It helps you grow as a person. It helps your personality grow faster. It helps your lifestyle and it even helps your life. And it even helps you become more positive. I think that's the only tip of out of all the important tips to step out of the comfort zone is probably this one. <laughs> Trust yourself and make snap decisions. Trusting yourself, uh, I think is the second most important 
tip to do of how to step out of the comfort zone. Making snap decisions is okay. Uh, it's fine. It's it's also important. It's just uh, you have to take some time, like I discussed to you about the second tip. Seeing yourself and be confident in yourself is very important. It's actually the second tip of uh, second most important tip of how to you know step out of the comfort zone in my personal opinion. I usually trust myself in doing the things that I like and sometimes don't like. So yeah, again, trusting yourself is the most important thing. An another most important thing to do uh, to step out of the comfort zone. So try to do that. Do it in small steps. This one is actually straightforward. If you do it in small steps, you will be incredibly successful of doing the things differently that you very rarely do. I cannot even tell you how many things that I did differently that I tr uh, tried my best to take some small steps, sna steps, snaps, steps to in order to, you know, follow them correctly and carefully. Trying to step out of the comfort zone in small steps is always very much important and always straightforward. Do it in small steps, you will become incredibly happy with what you do and what you are and what you have accomplished. So yeah, those are the tips uh, of how to, you know, step out of the comfort zone. If you guys enjoyed this video, please click the like button and comment down below to let me know what you think. If you really enjoyed what you've seen and if you want to see future videos from me, please click the subscribe button so that you never miss a video. I will see you guys next week with a brand new video. Have a great week, Battle Squad, and as always, fight the good fight. Peace!